asking for community support to help raise money to keep their building updated and maintained. WHSV's Chelsea Church explains. I remember growing up here, I had very fond memories and feel like this was so vital and central for the deaf community in Stanton. Since the late 1970s, the Shenandoah Valley Club of the Deaf has been a space for deaf people to come together to share their culture and create memories. We would like to reach out to our Stanton community to fundraise um, to renovate this building because um, hopefully in the near future when everything subsides, we can have um, our deaf space back again. Because of the pandemic, the deaf club has not been able to host events, which means there hasn't been any income to keep up with the needs of the space. We would like to have a ductless HVAC system uh, for both heat and AC to be mounted on the walls. Um, downstairs, we would need two of those units, upstairs one unit, but we don't have the funds for that, unfortunately. Wesley Airy says with it being the only deaf club left in Virginia, it's important to keep it an active part of the community. In Stanton, Chelsea Church, WHSV. Chelsea, thank you. Well, just weeks ago, Virginia Governor Northam announced he began proposing legislation to...